Hello there my fellow Holotable heroes and welcome to another Galactic Challenge video. Happy Monday everybody! Guess what guys, even though it's Monday, no Inquisitor Challenge today! Hey, let's celebrate it! Hopefully uh, this will last, it's not just a one on Monday off and then we'll back to Inquisitors, let's hope not. Uh, now so hopefully this one will be quite easy because it's just a ship challenge, so let's just get started. Okay, so we are taken to Jakku, where we have to take down a resistance fleet using droids, which means we will most likely be using Malevolence. Now, if you don't have Malevolence, you can still get it done as long as you have the other free droid ships that we have in the game with uh, IG-2000, Vulture Droid and Hyena. Uh, in terms of modifiers, uh, we've got Global here modifier for front deflector screen. Uh, nothing really too crazy about this one, however the last stand is going to be a little bit interesting because it does a few things but what you will mainly notice is that the first time each ship falls below 25% health they will gain damage immunity for one turn. Luckily this damage immunity can be dispelled uh, so it's not really too much of a nuisance as it seems to begin with. The modifier for droids is, I mean not worth mentioning really to be honest. Yeah, you get some extra offense and then whole target lock thing, but the enemies, they have <laughs> so high uh, tenacity, it seems, landing any sort of uh, debuffs is very, very hard, I think. So for the enemy modifier, uh, so whenever you resist uh, any sort of debuffs for them, uh, they will be gaining heal over time. And then this is probably what's really most important here, whenever they gain a buff, which with uh, riders there they're gaining lots of buffs they'll be getting some nice stat boosts but most importantly you will notice the 10% turn meter that they're beginning so they'll be taking quite a lot of turn now no matter what fleet you're taking in versus Rattus, the key uh, for stopping Rattus is basically dispelling their buffs, especially the deflector shield because as soon as they get a turn if they do have deflector shield they will gain foresight and then with foresight whenever they use special ability they will be reducing the cooldowns of the Holdo maneuver and obviously you don't want that to happen so you'll just have to find a way to keep removing those buffs whenever you can just to keep them under control. In terms of the feats actually it's probably one of the most straightforward um, fleet challenge we had in a while, no dodging, no critical hits, uh, no attacks out of turn, you literally just have to win while using free droid ships so if you're using Malevolence as capital ship, you only need two more droids there. Otherwise, as mentioned before, any other fleet with three droids will do. You have to win in with at least one light side and one dark side surviving. Not an issue as well. And then obviously complete the battle after gaining taunt three times. Again, very, very straightforward feat. So let's just, you know, stop wasting time here and let's jump into the first battle. Okay, so let's kick off with Malevolence. This, if you do have Malevolence, this is going to be probably the most straightforward one. You just need Hyena Bomber and Vulture Droid because uh, Malevolence itself is a droid ship, so it counts toward the free droid uh, ship's feet as well. Then just bringing in your Geos, and obviously you need some light side ships there. Uh, so I'm bringing both Ebon Hawk and Cassian's Ewing. They don't have to be high gear, they're just there for their dispel when um, they reinforce, really. That's all. But otherwise, uh, let's now go into battle and see how this one will go. Alright, let's begin the battle. Um, let's see... Okay, they get a jump start on us, some basics. Let's see if we can get a stun on Ray Scavenger. Oh, doesn't look like um, their Star Fortress is maxed, uh, maxed out, because it didn't turn there when we hit uh, Falcon. Okay, interesting. Alright, let's just keep going. As you can see they're heading lots of foresight, let's get some buzz droids there, perfect. And let's just go after Falcon first. Let's get more buzz droids. Okay, alright, here comes their AoE, ouch. Okay, come on, there we go. With Falcon out, I mean it's pretty straightforward, because these guys don't have a whole lot of firepower again. We just have to a little bit control their foresight. Um, so let's just go ahead and dispel foresight there as well. Uh, I'm going to bring in my first reinforcement here. Just gonna bring in Spy. Uh, see if we can blow up resistance uh, X Wing here. Oof, they're very durable, it seems. But we'll get there. Come on. Okay. 
got him down and I just have to uh, burn through this star fortress before they pull hold the maneuver. Oh, they got it out. Okay, let's see if we can still pull out a win here. Okay, so no <laughs> no command uh, uh, fleet, uh, no command ships on both sides. Oh, I'll just keep going. Come on, get him out. There we go. Got some buzzes over here. Okay. Uh, actually, let's hide Cassian in stealth because it has to survive. Okay, let's get that. There we go. And now we just have to get rid of Poe. So even though they pulled off hold the maneuver, it doesn't even matter. We're still able, hopefully, to clean up a lonely Poe. I'm uh, gonna hit damage immunity. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Basics. Basics. Okay, basics here as well. Come on. And there we go. So hopefully this now completed uh, all the feats in a single battle. Let's go ahead and check it out. You never know with this without a feat tracker. So yeah, we did use three droid ships. Malevolence counts. That's fine. We obviously gained the taunt many, many times and also uh, used at least one light side and one dark side unit surviving. I will try Negotiator next. Uh, so I'm just going in with this standard slanting lineup for Negotiator. Then obviously bring in Plow there for the reinforcement. And then you need the three droid ships to get this done. So let's just hop into battle. Uh, let's see if we can pull this one out without getting to hold the maneuver. Okay, here we go. All right, what I've got for us. Okay, um, let's... I mean, it's probably wishful thinking, but let's see if we can get a buff immunity. No, they're resisting everything, these guys. Okay, well, that didn't do much. Um, let's go ahead and actually uh, dispel Deflector Shield. And yeah, I'll just go all in our uh, X-Wing here. Come on. Uh, maybe dispel that as well. Just trying to get rid of all those buffs as much as you can. So you can then hopefully delay the hold of maneuver here. Okay, just keep going after pilot. Hey, we landed the debuff. Yay! Uh, okay, we might lose Ahsoka here in a moment. Oh no, Plo coming in for the rescue. Uh, let's get that uh, taunt tap over here on Plo. Okay, now luckily enemy isn't hitting very hard. They're just very durable. Okay, uh, I'll just keep going after um, X-Wing because we got it low in health already anyway. So come on. Okay, here comes the damage immunity. Let's get unending loyalty applied on our guys. Come on, there we go, X-Wing took a turn. Oh, uh, but we have... Alright, perfect, let's go ahead. Boom! Oh, it wasn't big enough, unfortunately. Stuck behind bigs. Okay. Alright. What they've got for us? Okay, they're healing up. There goes uh, Plo. I'll just keep going over here. And um, let's bring Hyena Bomber here. Let's get those bus droids a little bit out in the field perfect there we go x-wing died from the bus droid nice okay i'll get the bus droids applied here come the whole maneuver again all right let's see <laughs> Oh, they brought, brought in Poe this time, okay. Um, let's see if we can get Falcon out. There we go. Um, so they all have Foresight, unfortunately, so we'll just do Basics. Come on, come on, come on, get him out, get him out, and down they go. So you can see, these battles do drag on a bit, but eventually you do pull out a win. And finally, uh, I will also try out uh, Rebels here. And I mean, you can probably do this with any fleet. I just think that Rebels are a great option as well, just because on the Falcons we're getting, obviously, uh, all those, uh, on these basic attack dispelling or buffs. So hopefully, we can finally get a battle done without getting to hold the maneuver. 
let's see uh, if we can burn through these guys fast enough. Okay, they're putting ahead of big. Star Fortress definitely bugged. It doesn't do anything. It should, I don't know, weird one. Anyway, uh, let's go into hiding and I'm just going after Falcon. Just do a mass assist. We are not hitting very hard. These guys are very durable, it seems. Okay, here comes the AoE. Okay, that's fine. Let's just keep going. There we go. Okay. Uh, shield deflector. Man, these guys are absolutely resisting everything. Okay, there we go. Okay. What I got for us? Okay, bigs again. Um, so what I'll do, I'm bringing Cassian now. Now let's see if we can finally get some plays going here. There we go. Okay, come on Falcon assist. Falcon. Okay, let's spin. Um, let's see if we can get rid of that taunt. Perfect. Okay, they're coming in with AoE of their own. Uh, let's heal up Cassian actually. Okay. All right. Okay, let's finish off. Come on. There we go. We got Falcon out of here. Alright, looks like we'll finally be able to make it, maybe. Or do they have... Oh, no. No. They did it again. Oh, boy. Alright, we'll get through them, I'm pretty sure. Just hit auto this point. And there you go guys, uh, I wasn't quite able as well to finish them off, they're very durable, but I'm pretty sure some other fleets could get it done. And there you go guys, pretty easy and straightforward challenge to be honest, just use your best fleet that you have, uh, chuck in free droid ships and you should be able to quite easily get the red crate yet again. Thank you for watching guys, I'll see you in the next one, but until then have fun, enjoy life and may the RNG be with you my friends.